Hey everybody, welcome back. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching and Merry Christmas. Today we're gonna do the Christmas Craw. Just making it up as I go along, and I think it should be pretty fun. First, we're gonna start with some golden nickel azul yellow. New airbrush. Pretty excited about this. And we're just going to make a very blotchy pattern all over the upper portion of the body. Next, we're going to use some Titan Buff to fill in the gaps. Hang on a sec. The benefit to doing this step is that it helps kind of uh, take away from the brightness of the colors we're going to use next. It helps kind of give it that natural hue. Next, we're going to have some Detail Scarlet from Wicked Colors. Createx. Next up, some of the uh, quinacridone nickel azo gold. Next we'll just do a little dusting of the iridescent red. I like to put this over top of other uh, other reds, other oranges and everything else. I find if you put it directly on the on white, it, it turns out pretty pink almost. So just over top of other colors. Okay, next we're going to use the green gold for a light dusting along the belly. Just remember to keep your brush angled. So it pushes up the sides and it gets all of the underbelly of the gills and everything else. All right. Next up, permanent green light. Next we got some sap green hue. 
Again, just going for the randomness all over the belly. Bit up the sides. Anarchy models. This is the blotchy. Get that little bit of texture in there. Coming along. Okay, next up we're going to use some transparent red iron oxide. And now we're going to start working on just kind of blending everything in. So this is a bit embarrassing. I forgot to uh, hit record on this step after this one which included uh, spraying sepia down the back. You've seen me do this technique in other videos. Basically, loaded up with some golden sepia, sprayed it right down the middle, had it kind of bleed over the sides. Uh, then I put some focus just kind of on the head, around the eye, and it just really kind of helped tie things in together. You'll see in the next clip how, uh, how everything turned out. Sorry. Okay, we got some transparent black from Descartes. Sorry, everything else we've been using pretty much has been either some Createx Wicked Color or a Golden. We'll grab our cross stencil. Now the final step, we're going to use a bit of true gold. And just spray on the bottom side of the shell. Just for a little bit of 
extra shimmer. There. Actually, do you know what we'll do? We'll just darken up these eye holes just a little bit. Because it's Christmas, let's go with green. And no better way to finish off a Christmas lure than with a Santa hat, custom made by my daughter. There we go. All right. Thanks so much. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Have a great Christmas, everyone. Bye.